Welcome back for another video guys at the Crypto Lightsaber YouTube channel. I'm going to show you a little trick of the trade here. Um, and what we'll do is we'll have a quick look at the player chart, alright? Because I know you guys like these player updates. Uh, some of you, anyway. Why I say some of you is because I think sometimes, uh, you know, when you get into these Telegram groups, uh, uh, you know, you get people who kind of like slay people for selling any of their tokens not just with player but this happens in multiple communities all right now the whole point of people buying these tokens is to make a profit yeah buying cryptocurrency uh, you believe in the asset or whatever you know if you're gonna long-term hold you're gonna long-term hold if you're gonna trade it you're gonna trade it if you're gonna mid-term hold and you want to take some profit there's nothing wrong with that as well so I don't know why people slay people for taking profits you know, if you're taking profits, you're doing what's best for you. You're in this game to make money. You don't have to do what everyone else is doing. You've got your own strategy. Fair play to you. So don't let anybody bully you or make you feel like you're an idiot for taking profits. Okay? Just want to put that out there for anyone that might be uh, feel like they're being harassed by uh, immature people in web chats and telegram groups. Okay? right so let's have a look at the player chart all right player like i said in the previous video it looked like we could potentially see a double top um i would have liked to have seen it come up and carry carry on up but hope is not lost yet okay uh but as we can see on the one hour chart let's have a look on the one day um on the way one day it looked like it could have flagged in and went back up it did but then it got rejected off this level and it came back down and it looks like we need to get a bounce get a bounce off this level and you know see it go back up into the sky um but there's always a potential for it to drop below this level which would be a short-term danger zone potentially long term okay so going back to the one hour you can see that line matches up with this uh, support area. The last thing you would want is for this to break through, down through that support and get a candle close, come back up and hit this uh, support, which then becomes resistance and then carries on to the downside. Okay, so what we need to see here is we need to see a reversal anywhere around this point, uh, which could potentially show us a W pattern and then carry on to the upside. Just change the color of that for you so you can see that clearly. Okay, so that's what we would like to see at this point, a nice little W pattern to the upside. And that would see us in a better position, in a better position for player right now, okay? So yeah, guys, keep an eye on that. Um, for me, that's the danger zone down here, right down here, on anywhere under there. That's where I don't want to be, okay? Um, my long-term hold strategy is not to long-term hold a downtrend, okay? For those of you that think hodling is all about hodling and never ever selling, okay? Hoddle for life theory, okay? If I see a nice profit, you know, and I'm not talking about 5 10%, I'm not talking about 50%, in some cases, I'm not even talking about 100%. I'm talking about a thousand percent, two thousand percent, three thousand percent in these low cap gems. Okay. If I was, um, you know, it's not huddle for life, it's huddle for a profit. Okay. Uh, let's put that out there. Right. So, what I did earlier, I'll show you a little trick that you can do. Okay. So, if you look here, I've got it highlighted. I managed to sell. Obviously, you can see I'm an accumulating player. All right. So I managed to sell earlier half a million player, 499,252 player at a price of 189. Okay. Then I sent my, works out roughly about $100 worth of Bitcoin that did. All right. I sent my $100 worth of Bitcoin over here and I bought some player back for 177 okay and i ended up with 527,000. right so that's arbitrage okay um as you can see 499,000 
252. I turn that into 527,160 all in a matter of minutes with uh, there yeah, just by using uh, two different exchanges to pick some up so much so if we work that out it's 527,160 minus 499,252 equals so that's 27,908 player for free basically I then took that player and I sent it back over to Bitmark, back into my wallet, okay? So that's 27,908 player for free. Um, actually, bearing in mind that there is a fee of around 2,000 player withdraw from Bit, uh, from OceanX back to Bitmark. Okay, so roughly I got about 25,908 uh, player tokens for free. Okay. Now, I mean, that's, it's not life-changing money you know but it's free money at the end of the day that's a strategy you can use but you have to watch this like a hawk now i would have liked to have sold more player sent it over to ocean x and bought more player back but i can only take what the order book gives me all right so if you look for example now we've got the order book says there's um the lowest buy order on here unless you want to wait for one is at 168 okay now, I can't do it right now because if I sold at 168 and sent it over here, the buyback, the only, the lowest sell order is at 172. So that's four pips worth of a loss if I was to buy it back. You know, so it doesn't make sense to do it uh, uh, at the moment. Okay, I can only take what the order book gives me. And I'm not constantly scouring for these opportunities, but I'm constantly between these two charts when I am looking at player. I'm not glued to my computer staring at player all day but if i see it in the order book i'm an opportunist and i take the opportunity if i can increase my bag even if it's by twenty i i'll do it okay now time is not always on on your side and when it comes to doing this okay because obviously when you sell your player you've then got to get your Bitcoin or whatever asset it is that you're holding over into the other exchange in a good amount of time before the, the, the lowest order gets bought up by somebody else. Okay, which is what I use XRP for. Okay, so XRP is quite fast. It only takes one confirmation on the blockchain for it to go through. Okay, so what I do is I then take my Bitcoin when I've sold out a player, I sell out a player into BTC, okay? I then take my BTC and I go and I buy this XRP USDT. Okay, so on Bitmart actually, um, there is no XRP. No, 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 there is. There is. A, sorry, on Ocean X, there's no XRP BTC pair. Right, so then I sell it into XRP BTC, right? And then I withdraw my XRP BTC over to Ocean X. Now, Ocean X does not have an XRP BTC pair, but it does have an XRP USDT pair. So when it lands in my wallet, I then have to sell the XRP USDT into Teva. I then have to take my Teva and then buy BTC with that. Okay. And I buy my BTC with that. And then what I do is I take my BTC and I go back over to the player market and then I buy player with my BTC okay and that's how you do it fast because you want you don't want to wait two hours for Bitcoin because you may just have sold some of your player and you may not get it back at, the, at, at, at a lower price you may have to pay an ex more expensive price uh, uh, to get back in um, or you may just have to miss out and just you know throw your 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 btc into something else okay so yeah that's a quick way to make money you know it won't appeal to everyone you know it's not something that i search for looking for but in a few videos i have kind of mentioned that i do do that sometimes a lot of the time um if the opportunity presents itself i'll take it i don't care i'll take it you know it's, it's, it might be only twenty five thousand player okay but um, if i list how much is twenty five thousand player let's have a look Depends at the price. In fact, let me do it at the price that I bought it at, actually. 
25,000 there. 25,000 at the current price is at 179. Let's see. Let's see, 25,000 clear. Let's work out how much that actually is. Okay. Okay, I earned four dollars. <laughs> four dollars and twenty-six cents, roughly. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, four dollars for nothing. You know, I will still take it. You know. <sighs> some people get less uh, for chips in that than than. than uh, some people get less of that in tips in like super chat. Okay. So I mean, all for a few minutes work. You know. Someone's like a scalp. It's like a scalp trade, you know what I mean? Without having to wait for the ups and downs. Okay, so yeah, I mean, if you found some value in that, guys, leave me a comment down below. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, please do, you know what to do. Which is a quick video for you today, and I hope uh, you enjoyed it. Um, let me know what you think in the comments, guys. You know, um, when you do leave a comment, what, it, what happens is the YouTube algorithm pick that up, and, um, it makes the videos more popular and then makes my channel a little bit more popular okay I've got some great ideas for the channel guys so yeah subscribe and I'll go through those uh, with you guys in some of my other videos um, but yeah I think it will definitely add value to the community all right and like I said I'll discuss those at another time but yeah um, like the video if you found value in it and I'll see you again in the next one